Hey everybody, Scott Spritzer here, DocSports.com. I hope you're all doing well. We've got a free pick in Korean baseball for Wednesday, June 24th. 2020 coming up on this report. We'll get to that in a moment. Uh, hey, if you've yet to become a member over at DocSports.com, just want to give it a trial run, you just click on that link below the video, get yourself set up for a free $60 account, which you can use on any of my daily packages or anybody else on the roster at DocSports.com. It is as simple as that. Get started by clicking on the link below the video. A big day for me on Wednesday. I've got a six-star play in soccer. It is a day game. It will be available on Wednesday at 11.30 a.m. Eastern, 8.30 a.m. Pacific, DocSports.com, exclusively, as you know. And uh, we're coming off a win with Tottenham, easy 2-0 winner on Tuesday. And uh, we'll look to go to 3-1 and one in June, in the month of June, with my six-star plays. Again, that's a day game on Wednesday, and it will be available 11.30 a.m. Eastern, 8.30 a.m. Pacific. Uh, I do have a premium pick, big premium pick for uh, Korean baseball, which goes on Wednesday at 5.30 a.m. Eastern. It's available right now on my Handicappers homepage. And if you wish to jump on board, uh, just remember that you'll have to do so by about 12.45 a.m. Eastern time. It's about the time uh, that the plays will be uh, removed from the site. So be sure to grab that before that time. It is a 5.30 a.m. Eastern time game in Korean baseball on Wednesday morning, available right now up until 12.45 a.m. Eastern uh, over at DocSports.com for Wednesday's card. But a big soccer play on Wednesday available on a Wednesday morning over at Doc Sports. Uh, we'll have NASCAR this week again. Uh, we did win the top play on Monday. Uh, we went one and one, but we made a profit because our top play won with Eric Amarola getting us a nice matchup winner. And uh, so we'll head into next week 29 and 13 with the last 42 plays in NASCAR. And uh, we will have those plays. We'll talk more about it. We'll get to the weekend. We'll post the plays on Sunday. Sunday morning. Uh, let's get to the free pick for Wednesday. What do you say? We're talking about Hanwha and Samsung, and we're going to recommend a play on Samsung laying a run and a half right now. It's around even money. You might have to lay a little bit on that run and a half with Samsung, but uh, boy, we got a big pat, uh, pitchy matchup advantage. If you look at the kid going for Hanwha, he's just been a disaster thus far. 689 ERA, 211 whip. He's given up four home runs in his last three starts, which is only 12 and two-thirds innings and you know this isn't the greatest home run hitting league but he walks a ton of batters he is just giving up walk after walk 23 walks uh, in 32 and two-thirds innings pitch so it's a situation where not only is he not showing control uh, but he's also given up the long ball he's given up a lot of runs compared to the amount of innings that he's pitched and his only win or his last win he's one in four on the season means he's got one more win than you and I do so far this Korean baseball season. Seven starts. His lone win came way back on May 7th against SK. So it's a situation where I think he's just a sitting duck again and uh, probably going to be tagged pretty good by Samsung, who, by the way, playing better baseball. They're 8-4 and four in their last 12. Uh, they're scoring runs. And that's the one thing that if you're Samsung, you don't have to worry a whole lot about in all likelihood out of the Eagles is the fact that they're going to score a lot of runs. They are 10th. They are dead last in the KBO in runs per game, uh, team batting average, on base percentage, slugging percentage, right down the line, every important uh, metric on offense uh, that I care about by the Eagles, they're dead last or close to it. In fact, their walk percentage on offense, dead last. Their strikeout per percentage, dead last. It's just been a horrible season for Hanwha. Ten wins is all they have on the season. The problem is, is that defensively they stink too. They're dead last in runs per game allowed, uh, opponents batting average allowed, OBP allowed, slugging percentage allowed right down the line. So listen, Samsung is heating up a little bit. They've got uh, 23 runs on the last couple of the games. As I mentioned, they've won eight of the last 12 games overall. Big pitching matchup advantage, starting to score runs. Let's back Samsung minus a run and a half on a Wednesday morning. Again, Samsung minus one and a half runs on a Wednesday. And I'm looking at a bunch of books and it looks like basically even money. I might have to lay a little bit of juice depending on where you shop. It's going to do it for me for Wednesday. Don't forget about that big six star soccer play on Wednesday. It will be available at 1130 a.m. Eastern, 830 a.m. Pacific. It is a day game in soccer action on Wednesday, so be sure to grab that if you wish. I'm Scott Sprites or DocSports.com. Let's put Wednesday in the win column right back here Wednesday night between 8 p.m. Eastern and 10 p.m. Eastern time.